So let's take a look at Paladins on my Windows 10 VMware player uh, VM. I, I actually have no idea. I've never played Paladins. I only know how to play Paladins a little bit. Oh, I can play against AI. Would that be lame if I played against AI? Would you guys hate that? I don't think it's that big of a deal. I'm just going to go with casual. What the hell? Okay, that was fast. Are we playing or what? I guess we're playing. That was really weird. I didn't even have like a choice. Oh, okay, here we go. What am I supposed to do here? Yeah, sure, let's join it. Select a champion. Oh, jeez. Um, you can only play certain guys. We'll play him because that's who I played in the tutorial. He's kind of lame. I mean, Team Fortress 2 doesn't even have just like an assault rifle guy. You have a heavy and a soldier. I guess, honestly, the medic might be as close to an assault rifle using person, but you don't play them. You don't generally play a medic like that. So this is not necessary. This is about as close to 720p as it's going to get. It's like 7, 768 or something. I didn't want to scale the the width or whatever. So, but I wanted to run it in a window so you could see that this is a, a VM. So this should be interesting. I wonder what these are. Oh, that's my microphone and that's my headset. Okay. So let's see how this ran. When I played the tutorial, there were some times where it slowed down like a lot. Uh-oh. I might have to play this at full screen because my mouse keeps leaving. What is all this? Sure. Oh, did it capture it? Okay, no, it captured it. Wow, the mouse is like... Really... Wow, the graphics are also... Oh, it's loading it. Oh, wow, look at that. It's like popping in and out. The textures are going up or something. So I guess this game is an awful lot like uh, Overwatch. I've never played Overwatch. I'm a pretty big Team Fortress 2 fan, so I understand that Overwatch is kind of like uh, Team Fortress 2. What on earth is going on here? Why are we on horses? Why on earth are we on horses? Like, if the battlefield was that far away, then... Well, guys, I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. Wow, this is really weird. If I could just kill one person in this, I'd be fine. Wow, I don't do, like, any damage at all. Yeah, I killed... Oh, I killed two people. Okay, yeah, this is... Okay, this is doable. <laughs> this this just seems really weird. Like, this is a game with heroes and stuff, and I'm playing just basically a soldier. Like, like legit soldier. Oh, wow. What, what class on Overwatch has that? It's like a, a direct ripoff of whoever that is. Like, I don't play Overwatch. I don't really watch Overwatch videos, but I've seen enough of them to know that there is a class that is known for having that effect. Oh, there's also somebody with a hook. That's, that's also another person off of Overwatch. See that a lot. Hey, I killed somebody. Escort the payload? I didn't realize this was a pay payload match. Has the payload been here the whole time? I just didn't even notice. So my ultimate is counting up. Counting up? Is that a percentage? Yeah, it is a percentage. Okay. So that's interesting. What the hell? Oh, no. Get out. The mouse is really sluggish. I would turn up the... The, um sensitivity, but it's like I'm a little late. I haven't even died. Can you believe that? I have not died. 
I have like this hustle ability. I'm not even using it. Oh, is that another guy? It is. Wow. On Team Fortress 2, I auto reload. This I have to like tell it to reload. I mean, maybe there's a way to auto reload, but ah, he pushed me. Oh, I finally kicked the bucket. So should I increase my mouse sensitivity? You can play with the controller. It's not that sensitive, or it's not that unsensitive, so let's go up to 32. You challenge Makoa? I mean, it's it's running pretty well. There are certain games where the mouse goes just like totally nuts and it's basically not playable. EverQuest 2 did that. If you notice in the video where I did EverQuest 2, I think it was like gaming, Linux gaming on VMware or something. I can't remember what I called it. The 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 clip of EverQuest, I my mouse goes like totally nuts. And I tried to edit some of it out because I didn't want to like talk about, oh yeah, some games have problems. Like that wasn't the point of that video. But I'll, I'll do a video about, I'll, I'll probably do videos playing the games that have problems so you guys can see that it's not, it's not perfect. But this game doesn't appear to have the mouse issue. Man, I don't like that guy. Oh shit. No, if I'm gonna die. Who is that guy? He's a pain in the ass. Endeavor? I don't like you either. Oh, he's a turtle. Oh, wow. Oh my god, this is just like Overwatch. Like I said, I don't even watch Overwatch videos, but I've seen enough to clips to know that this is just like Overwatch. Oh wow, I don't want to jump into the water. Uh, but I'll say this, it's not bad. In the game itself doesn't play bad at all. Like, I, I haven't noticed anything. I'm probably towards the top. Oh my Christ, I am at the top of my team. That is not good. I have never even played this game. Does that mean that I'm good, or does that mean that everybody just sucks? What's that meme? Like, I'm at the top of the team, so it means that my team sucks? That's kind of how I feel right now. That can't be what that means. Am I really at the top of the team? I don't want to purchase items. I don't really know what to do here. I just want to play. I don't want to... No, I'm not going to buy any of this stuff. I just want to play. I don't know what the hell we're doing back in spawn. I'm probably doing something terrible. You guys are probably like, you're supposed to buy stuff. I don't want to buy stuff. I just want to play. That's why I like Team Fortress 2. Like, it's it's just so simple. You just go out and you kill. Sometimes there's an objective like push the payload cart or capture this point or something. But you basically just kill the other side. There's no no ultimate attacks. There's no buying of items or anything, you just go. And I love that. I mean, I guess I could. Did I do that right? Given that nothing's falling from the sky, I'm gonna go with no. I thought I have had to do that in the uh, tutorial and it seemed fine. I don't know what I did wrong. Oh, you son of a bitch. I almost got him. Oh, I did get him, actually. I think he killed me, though. Oh, who the hell? So, if you're wondering, actually, you should probably already know. Can't play Overwatch on this because VMware only supports up to DirectX 9, or DirectX 10. And uh, Overwatch requires 10.1. So there is a difference. Whoever that guy is, he's really good. Nice. You not realize you were dead? You had like a sliver of health. I don't understand. Do I get flanking damage if I attack people from behind? Oh, I'm dead. I, I was about to hit E to call for a medic, but I don't think it works that way. Can I heal? I am almost dead. Somebody's just like hosing. Do I have ammo? I just realized I'm, I'm just like hosing and I don't think I have ammo. Oh, 
Am I playing against bots? This seems stupidly easy. I don't understand. Like, and no offense to, like, people that are playing, but I shouldn't be able to just walk up to people and hose them like that. That's ridiculous. This, like, I don't understand. 20 kills and 4 deaths? And this is the first time I've played this game? Wow. Oh, nice. He got wasted. So we didn't get any further than this last time, so maybe we can push the cart a little bit further. I don't know who this asshole is with the shield, but I hate him. Why are you just standing there? I don't understand. I will not die. Not yet. No, well, hold on. I can, I can help you on that journey. There we go. This makes me just want to play heavy with my minigun. I just sit and hose everybody. I don't know what the hell's going on. So what would you guys say the frame rate is? It could it'd probably be better if I had it full screen because it's if if you know how window compositing works, it's the GPU is having to composite everything that we're seeing right now. And when an OpenGL application is full screen, it only has to composite or do any sort of 3D acceleration for that one screen. So because I'm running this window mode, it has to do 3D acceleration for not only the whole screen, but also, oh no, but also uh, not only for the game, I mean, it has to do 3D acceleration for the game, but also everything in the background. So let's go ahead and blow this up and see what happens. So I don't know how the game's gonna react to it. Okay, it seems okay. Uh-oh, I hit uh, return to game and it went to options. Oh no, actually. So let's see if it's any different. So it's all like subjective. There's no way to, I guess, prove that the frame rate has increased. It actually seems a bit more choppy, to be honest. Well, it, actually, you know what? It's evened out. Yeah, I think it's gone up. What do you guys think? Let me let me know what you guys think in the comments, whether or not that had a, a, a positive impact. Now I'm getting my ass handed to us. I was doing really good. Four, four deaths and 20 kills, and now I'm at seven deaths and four kills, so. Eh, I, would, I was expecting bigger gains, actually. I mean, it's I guess it's maybe five or more frames faster or better, but. I was expecting more. Is now a good time to use this? Did I get that? That's hard to do. I don't really like that. All right. Who's the robot? I don't know who any of these characters are. Is it even worth knowing? Like, the cool thing about that I've seen about Overwatch is the characters are all, like, really unique with their own personalities and stuff. These guys seem really, like, dull. Like, they're trying really hard to copy Overwatch. I mean, it, don't get me wrong. Like, the game is fun, but I don't know. Team Fortress 2 is pretty original. I played the original Team Fortress, and Team Fortress 2 isn't really anything like it, so... All right, I think I'm going to wrap this up. I don't want to keep playing. But, yeah, this was pretty fun. What do you guys think? I think it ran pretty well. It's definitely playable. Like, if you were a huge Paladins fan and you just you couldn't switch to Linux because you had your, you had to play your Paladins, it, you know, just don't do a boot. Just run Windows in a virtual machine, and, and uh, it should be fine. So, for the next video, we could take a look at World of Warcraft, League of Legends. There's a whole bunch of stuff in Battle.net. I know that I've seen people ask about Hearthstone. Diablo 3 is in there. Warframe is another one that people have brought up. Uh, everything runs just fine. Hearthstone, Heroes of the Storm was uh, one I think that I've seen people talk about. And of course, Overwatch, which I will play the second it is. Uh, DirectX 10.1 is available in VMware. But until then, we won't be able to play it. So I'm going to wrap this up. This was pretty fun. Stay tuned for the next VMware video. 
See you later.